Good evening, Hortisan. How are we all today? Oh, it's Tuesday and it's blooming freezing. I don't know about everybody else. I'm absolutely frozen. I've got a scarf on around my shoulders. I'm going to go and get my pyjamas on once this live has finished, I think, and tuck myself up under a duvet. Um, so this evening, um, normally it would be Chrissy this evening, but she's having the night off. Um, in fact, she's had the day off today, which I don't blame her because it's her daughter's birthday. So she's been spending the day um, with her daughter celebrating her birthday. Um, so she's gone out for family meal and various things. Um, so good on her. She deserves a nice break. So I am um, taking Chrissy's place this evening. Um, and then Wednesdays we have a break and then Thursday I think will be me and Friday maybe Chrissy I think unless we swap those over again um, so usually you see us both twice a week or Fridays we might come on together we mix it up a bit because it just keeps it nice and fresh um, so I'm just going to double check that I am live in the on the page yes I am so what's everyone been up to today um do you have a routine on a Tuesday do you do anything specific um I have a little bit of a trivia um post going on over on my page so if you know any bits of trivia um that you think people might find really interesting pop over to my page um, which is creations where ideas come alive take part in my Tuesday trivia um, we have a lady here at Hartazan called Amy from Rainbow Poochie and um, she does a lot of quizzes so she's got all these magnificent facts um, that she's been sharing on my page and I'm learning things it's really really interesting so if you know any trivia pop on over um, the bit of trivia that I know is that um, all packets of crisps expire on a Saturday. Now, if you don't believe me, you've got packets of crisps in your house, go and check out the expiry dates on them and you'll find every single one expires on a Saturday. I didn't believe it um, until um, I found this piece of trivia out at some point last year, this was, and I literally went through every packet of crisps in the house and it's true. It's true, and it's something to do with the production line. Um, so they start their production on a Sunday, their new batch of production. So that's why all their packets, all, every packet of crisps expires on a Saturday, because then your fresh pack starts, um, your fresh process starts on a Sunday. So there you go. Um, evening, Claire. So you are packing up for a craft fair for Sunday. Oh, I hope it goes well, lovely. I um, hope you've got lots of your your melts and things and I hope the weather's better um, wherever you are I hope you know it's um it's not going to be as cold and windy and we've had a little flurry of snow here today in the Midlands um, it's been trying to snow a couple of times but only only coming you know just dropping down a little bit out of the air and and then kind of disappearing so um, Amy I was just talking about that about the post on my page and all this information that you've got stored in your head it's amazing all the, all the all the trivia that you know um i'm learning lots from you you're a very clever lady very clever <laughs> keep it going keep it going share it um get other people involved as well it's really 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 good right then so this evening i'm going to be showing off um some of the shops um, from our creatives who are in the artisan toolbox package which is our middle package um, got some fabulous um, shops to show you um, I'm going to try and keep this um, short and sweet this evening because I'm absolutely froze and I want to put my pyjamas on and my dressing gown and snuggle up under a duvet and get warm so I think I've got five shops to show you so I'm going to show you a couple of items from each of the shops and um, we will see how we go. So let me uh, share the screen and then flip the camera over and let's see who we have up first this evening. So 
First up this evening, we have, um, let me just check, I think this is Anasa. Yeah, this is Anasa's shop, um, and it is Rainbow Roses Handmade. Um, now, this shop is absolutely gorgeous. Um, she makes fantastic um, wax candles, lots and lots of gorgeous fragrances to choose from. Um, so let's just have a look and see what exciting flavours and scents she's got. I always call them flavours, but I suppose they're scents, aren't they? Because you're not going to eat them. Although I bet they smell like you could eat them. Um, so let's see what scents she has. Let's click on this first one. These are a fantastic price as well. Um, so here we have a relaxing soy wax candle for £12. So this is black, amber and lavender, a unique and complex blend of rustic amber and French lavender with added notes of tonka, bean and um, clary sage, or clary sage, I'm not quite sure how you pronounce that. Even that picture is enticing, lavender is such a beautiful, beautiful smell um, and it is good for relaxation as, as said there. Um, it's, you know, it aids restful sleep. I know you can buy lavender sprays that you can put on your pillows as well. Um, so let's have a little look. So this is a soy wax candle, so it's the perfect addition to any home. Um, it's part of the Mindful collection in which there are six candles. Um, so you could, you know, pick your favourites or perhaps collect them over a period of time. So you've got um, different scents. Um, so this has top notes of lemon and bergamot, uh, middle notes of lavender and clary sage, and base note of tonka bean and vanilla amber. Um, the measurement of the candle is 87 millimeters in height and 74 millimeters in diameter. So if you are somebody who likes to get home from work, um, get out your work clothes, put your feet up, light a candle, just have that you know moment of relaxation from a busy working day, perhaps after the children have gone to bed, um, then something like this would be ideal for you. Oh, I've lost me comments. Let me see you get me comments back. Do you know what, Amy? I haven't got a cold, but I think it's when I get cold that I start to sound as though I've got one. Um, I mean, I had a sore throat the other week, um, but that's gone. Um, so, yeah, I don't know what it is, unless I've got something brewing, because... I had a bit of a sore, tickly throat, but it didn't come out as a cold. So whether I've got something that's, you know, brewing, which would be great, wouldn't it? Um, so there we go. Oh, we have somebody new watching us. Welcome. Welcome, Abdul. Or Abdul. Sorry if I've pronounced your name wrong. It's nice to have you with us. Um, tell us where you're watching from and how you found us. That would be great. Um, yes, her product pictures and branding are amazing. Yes, absolutely, Amy. So I'm going to go and have a look what other scents she has. Uh, we've got a rejuvenate candle. That sounds lovely. Happiness. We all need a bit of happiness, don't we? Um, let's have, oh, she does room sprays as well. So let's have a look. Um, which one shall we have a look at? Let's go for this yeah. one. Yeah. Take a break room spray. So here we have a take a break room spray, 50 ml bottle for three pounds yeah. 30. Yeah. Um, are you always looking for a strong, fresh fragrance to help keep your room fresh and smelling lovely? Tired of air fresheners that don't live up to their descriptions? Well, look no more as we pride ourselves in only using the best quality fragrance oils that live up to their description. So, it, oh, you can pick three different scents here. So you can choose from fresh coffee, uh, fresh ginger and green tea, or lychee and black tea. 
Um, oh, I don't know which one I'd go for. Probably the ginger, because that'll have a bit of a kick to it, won't it? Um, so let's have a look if we come down here. Um, so as I said, it's a 50ml bottle. Um, as I said, and there's three to choose from. Um, so what have we got here? So they currently only ship to the UK at present, but are looking to go international. So keep an eye out um, in case you want to purchase when they go um, purchase, posting further afield. So there you go. So as well as candles, they do room sprays. And oh, they do keepsake charms as well. So let's have a look at this. So here we have for two pound sixty a um, in loving memory pet keepsake charm, um, and you can also have personalisation on this. Um, so you can have a pet's name, a type of pet, or a breed, um, and you've got a little text box here so that you can add your personalisation. Um, so that's a lovely idea, isn't it? So if you know somebody who is a pet lover. Um, or someone who has recently lost a pet, then um, this would make a lovely gift for them, just to let them know that you are thinking of them. Um, and you can use this charm to clip onto a bag or a key ring. So it's an ideal little gift, um, just to let someone know that you are thinking of them. And that's beautifully presented in a, a little pocket there. Absolutely lovely. So there you go, there's a little look at um, Rainbow Roses Handmade. So if you want to have a look at what else they do, then do pop over and have a look. Um, lots of different memorial candles and gift sets um, and keepsake charms. So a lovely little shop. Um, so make sure you go and have a look. So I'm just going to check the comments again before we move on to the next shop. Um, nope, you're still with me guys thank you right then so next up I'm going to jump over to our king of chocolate our resident chocolatier um, which is Dale who is also one of our madmen um, he's the only um, male madmen on our team um, and he fits in really well bless him amongst mm -hmm. all us females um, he does a grand job of looking after um, our new creatives that also come onto the marketplace um, and he helps them with any Etsy um, uploads as well um, but he is a fabulous creator of all things chocolate and cake so I'm just going to show you um, some of his latest items now obviously we have Valentine's Day um, coming up shortly um so he um what other way to you know um than some gorgeous gorgeous chocolate um and he does chocolate for lots of occasions and i know i've seen his easter eggs as well i think they're on here we'll have a quick look at those in a moment but for valentine's day um he does things like these gorgeous um belgian chocolate lollies obviously these aren't just for valentine's day you can have these for any occasion but they are a fantastic price of one pound fifty, um. So they're great, um. Even for like Christmas time for stocking fillers and things like that. So you can order them later on in the year. Um. He does lots and lots of styles in his um lollies, um. So for kids and adults, um. I love Dale's chocolate. I buy it quite regularly, um. As well as his hot chocolate spoons, um. So they are a real real treat. Um, so let's have a look with these you have a choice of chocolate that you can have so you can have milk chocolate or dark chocolate which is vegan friendly um, and these um, are Belgian hot chocolate Belgian chocolate lollies um, which are also colored pink um, made from the finest Belgian chocolate um, so the pink is a shimmer coating um, perfect way to show someone how much you love them or a treat for yourself or someone close to you. Um, all the ingredients are listed on all of Dale's listings. 
um, that is a legal requirement and everything you purchase from him also has um, labels on them as well um, which is how it should be so you can see all the ingredients at a glance um, so if you've ever got any questions about that just drop down a message he's extremely helpful um, and just to let you know a little bit about Dale um, I think he he is still our youngest um, creative on the marketplace he's 21 years old and has been running his own business for four years um, so he first started his business making sweet cones and sweet trees for parties and then expanded into balloons bought a sweet cart and started making cakes after watching his mom for a few years um, so in October 2017, he started making chocolate truffles and since then has grown his range of chocolate gifts and treats. He currently offers 15 different flavours of truffles, um, including some alcoholic ones and many other products, including chocolate bars, chocolate shoes and make your own chocolate lolly kits. Um, and he also makes fantastic cakes, um, which he also sells through his Facebook page. Um, I don't think he has them on here. Um, I think this is just purely for his chocolate. Um, but he does some fa fantastic items. I can recommend the chocolate covered marzipan. That's one of my favourites. I bought some of that at Christmas um, and I've just ordered some more. And in fact, I've got a parcel to collect from the post office. Um, and I believe it might be my order from Dale um, because I know it has been shipped. Um, he also does these gorgeous um, deluxe chocolate gift boxes. Um, £14.50 for two drawers. Um, you get nine chocolates um, in each drawer. Um, so again, perfect for a little pick-me-up for somebody. The top layer is, um, they're all heart-shaped um, chocolates. And then the bottom one, you can select your own flavours. Um, out of a choice of two flavours for the bottom layer. Uh, the top layer is standard. Um, so let me just tell you what the top layer is. The top drawer contains nine Belgian chocolate and raspberry hearts, three in each flavour of milk, white and dark. And then as I said, the nine um, on the bottom layer, you can choose two different flavours for that layer out of your favourites from the drop down box here. And they are... Uh, Bailey's Prosecco Brandy, Raspberry and Hibiscus Gin, which I think is one of his newer flavours. Whiskey, Rum, Mint, Raspberry and Orange. Um, I personally like the Raspberry and the Orange. Uh, they're two of my favourites. Um, I just like those um, flavours in chocolate anyway. So there you go. Um, and with these, you can also select um, what colour drawer you want. So again, he's got a choice of red, purple, gold or turquoise for the colours of the drawers. Um, so if you know somebody um, who you want to give these to, who have got a favourite colour out of those four, then you can personalise the box even further by selecting their favourite colour. So I'm just going to check the comments again before we move on. I'm going to make you hungry. <laughs> Sorry, Amy. It does that, doesn't it, when you see um, some chocolate or, or some cake? It's like, ooh. Um, Dale's chocolate is the only chocolate that doesn't give you toothache. There you go. Best chocolate, that's why. Um, so here are the hot chocolate spoons that I spoke about again lots of different um, kinds so you've got the vegan syrup hot chocolate spoons um, you've got some for children which have got dinosaurs or I believe unicorns on um, you've got your standard marshmallow hot chocolate spoons um, an absolutely fantastic choice let's just have a quick flick over to the next page and see what else there is so again here you can see he does subscription boxes um, so you can select um, a vegan chocolate lovers treat box um, or he does a larger size so 
yeah, check check out his shop for the subscriptions. Um, because I know they go up in size and obviously in price, um, based on the contents. Um, chocolate hearts, these are very popular, not just for Valentine's, but these are popular all year round. Um, for birthdays, for Christmas, for any occasion. So just to give somebody a chocolate heart to tell them that you love them and thinking of them. Um, Father's Day coming up. Um, so you can have a chocolate toolbox. These are £5.50. And you can have a personalised label on these as well. Um, so you can have, these are just um, standard, standard choice. So uh, dads, daddy, granddads, stepdads, fathers, grandpas. Um, I'm sure if there's another combination that you would like, if you use another um, name for uh, the men in your life, then um, I'm sure you could request that. Um, and you can also, again, select the kind of chocolate you want, so milk, white or dark. So there you go. So though, there's a quick rundown of some of Dale's gorgeous mm. products. Um, and there's even more. So there's a, a few more pages there. So please go over um, and have a look because he has a huge, huge range. Even your vegan hazelnut chocolate spread there for £4.50. Um, so you can spread it on your favourite, um, you know, your toast or whatever. Um, or like some people do, just get a spoon and eat it straight out the jar because it's amazing. So there you go. Just going to check the comments again before I move on. Yeah, I may. Have you, have you had the chocolate spoons before? I love the chocolate spoons. In some hot milk. Mm, mm, nice. Mm. Right then, I'm now going to move on to another shop here. Um, let me just check. I think this might be Helen's. Yeah, Helen's shop because she's quite new to us. Just wanted to make sure I got her name right. Um, so the next shop uh, is the Crafty Blue Cow. Now, I just think that is a fantastic name. I love the logo um, of this gorgeous cow. Um, I just think he's cheeky. He's quirky. He just makes me smile every time I see him. Um, yeah, I just think I just think he's really sweet. So let's have a look what Helen does. So we have a variety here of um, coin holders and key rings. So what shall we have a look at first? I'll go with the first one. Let's have a look. Because I've not looked at Helen's shop before. I've seen her logo, but I haven't looked at her her products. So. Here we go. So these are embroidered trolley pound coin holder key rings. Now it's a brilliant idea because you can guarantee every time you go shopping, you've got to scrabble for a pound because you haven't got one. Um, so if you have something like this and have it with you all the time, you're never going to get sh caught short when you need to go to the shop and get some shopping and you need to get a trolley because you decide, oh, I need more than a basket's worth. I do that all the time and end up getting way too much. Um, so these would be ideal. Um, so never be without your trolley pound coin again with these handy embroidered holders. And it holds two coins securely. So there you go. Not just one, but two coins. That's brilliant. Um, lots of designs to choose from. So you can enter your choice in the boxes below. So you can enter your personalised details. You can enter your colour choice and you can enter your design choice. So let's have a little look at some of the choices we have. So as we can see in the picture here, we have a cute little doggy. Um, we have a bear. I'm going to go across. We've got tulips. Um, if I go the other way, oh, we have another bear but in a different colour. And then if I go up, we have an initial, so you can have initials instead. Um, cherries, and again, cherries, but in a different colour. And oh, I'm not quite sure what that one is. Not quite sure what that one is. Um, and if I click on this picture here, it just shows you um, what they look like inside. So there you go, you've got your sections there. 
um, yeah. enough for two pound coins, one in each side, and they obviously pop shut to um, they pop together and for closing, and then you've got your large lobster clasp for attaching them. So you've always got them with you. I think these are a brilliant idea. Um, absolutely fantastic. You always need a pound coin when you just suddenly decide, oh, I'll go shopping on the way home from work. So let's have a look. Unicorns. We like a unicorn. Um, here we go. Everyone loves unicorns, don't they? So this is an embroidered unicorn key ring, stroke charm, stroke fob. Um, so again, you can hang this off your keys or your handbag. £4.50. Um, fully embroidered. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's, so it's handmade in the UK. can be embroidered in different colours. Just add your colour choice into the text box as part of your order. Um, so it's made from vinyl, so it's easy to clean and hard wearing. Size is approximately four inches long when closed. Um, can accommodate most colours, so again, just drop a message if you want specifics. Um, and that can be done for you. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely lovely. Just going to click. There's a whole uh, group of them there, look. Amy, did you say there was a name for a group of unicorns? Remind me. I'm sure you, you said there was a name for a group of unicorns. Was it a sparkle? Or was that something else? Because I know you like the unicorns. I think I've got a little bit of a lag on my comments as well. So... Let's have a look what else. So we've got a camper van. So lots and lots of designs here. Something for everybody because we're not all the same. Everybody likes something different. Um, and let's have a look what else we've got. Oh, a blessing. That was it. So a um, a group of unicorns is called a blessing. There you go. And a baby unicorn is a sparkle. I knew sparkle came into it somewhere, but I couldn't remember. I've got a brain like a sieve. You, you told me something and I couldn't even remember it. Um, so let's have a quick look at this tooth fairy holder. And then we'll pop on and have a look at our next page. So this is an embroidered tooth fairy pillow. Uh, 9 .99. Uh, great for when your child loses their tooth and is waiting for the tooth fairy to arrive. There's currently two of these in stock. So if you would like one, um, then be quick. Um, so let's have a look. Um, so this is a great pillow to pop onto the bottom of the bed or onto the door handle in your child's room. That way you won't have to scrabble under the pillow to find the tuff. Just pop it into the pocket and the tuff fairy can collect the tuff and leave a coin for when your child wakes up. I know only too well um, the stress that that used to cause me when my daughter was young. Um, especially when it was like late at night and I suddenly remembered I hadn't done the tooth fairy duty and then had to scrabble to try and find the said tooth under her pillow and she'd either moved it from where it was um, because obviously getting excited about the tooth fairy probably checking every five minutes it was still there and th there was one occasion where I think I got up in the morning and suddenly realised I hadn't done my duty and I was trying to find the tooth and I couldn't find it and it actually fell from under her pillow onto the floor wrapped up or in a little pouch, whatever I'd put it in. And I was trying to have to scrabble on the floor to do the exchange before she woke up. And I think I just about managed it before she woke up. Um, so it's so stressful. This would have been so much easier to have something like this hanging on the door or the, or the, the you know, the foot of the bed. Um, so again, you can leave your details when ordering with your child's name so it can be personalised. And again, um, he's happy to accommodate most colours. Um, so he's happy to discuss what will make the perfect tooth fairy pillow. 
So again, a fantastic personalised service there um, for that one. So again, another new creative to Heartisan. It's a beautiful, beautiful creation. So please make sure you pop on over and have a look in depth at the other items in her shop. So next, I'm going to jump over to Gorgeous Gifts, created by Stitched Up. Oh, excuse me. Ooh. So here we have the lovely Angela from Gorgeous Gifts. So um, Angela is a fantastic seamstress. She does all things to do with sewing. Um, she creates beautiful storage baskets, um, sewing themed hampers, um, weighted pyramids, mats for underneath your um, sewing machine and so, so much more. Mm -hmm. So let's have a little look at some of them. Oh, what should I go for? I normally look at the baskets so let's not do those today. Let's find something I haven't looked at for a while. Um, go on to one of the other pages. She does so many gorgeous items and lots of different fabrics you can choose from as well. So um, there's bound to be a fabric that you'll find that will suit you. So let's have a look at these tote bags. So um, she can personalise these for you. So this one is a craft slogan, cotton tote bag, a crafter's gonna craft. And that's what we were put on this planet to do. We were born to craft. Never stop a crafter from crafting. So why not have that slogan on your bag um, with your latest project in? Perhaps you're somebody who likes to go and visit a friend and takes a little project with you so that you can both craft together over a cup of coffee or something. Take your bits and pieces in one of these fabulous tote bags. They're made from 100% recycled cotton. Um, or you could just use them if you're popping down to the shop just to get a few bits and pieces. You can use them for whatever you would like. So, let's have a look what else it says. So they measure 40 centimetres by 38. Um, they have short handles. Um, but it's easy enough to just like roll the bag up, tuck it under your arm. Um, when you pop off down to the shops to get your bits and pieces. Um, you can have the um, slogan done in holographic sparkle. Um, so a little bit about Angela here as well. Um, Angela is obviously the founder of Gorgeous Gifts. Um, she is a native Cornish woman who absolutely loves living in Cornwall, feels blessed because of it. Being surrounded by the countryside, which is perfect for walks and losing oneself. With the ocean close by, I am easily inspired. Oh, it'd be so lovely to live by the sea, wouldn't it? Absolutely would be wonderful. We always enjoy going on holidays where there's um, sea involved and having a stroll along the beach. Um, picking up shells and you know, having a little paddle in the sea can't swim in the sea. I can swim, but I don't swim in the sea. I just like a little paddle. Let's have a look what else we can find. I just love Angela's shop because there's always such fabulous, gorgeous items in there. So you might know someone that um, is a keen crochet or knitter. Um, so you could get them a set of six stitch markers. Mm -hmm. Sorry, a set of five stitch markers for six pound. Saw the six and read that the wrong way around. Um, so again, a great little gift for somebody um, that you know is into those hobbies. And I know if I click on that photo there, you can see um, some of the other sets that she also has available. Um, so lots of different designs there. I'm sure you will find something um, perfect for someone that you know um, so let's have a look what it says about these so these um, stitch markers are compiled using three small charms uh, which include a tape measure, a ball of yarn and scissors um, so this refers to one set in particular which is, let's go back to the original photo 
So the set we're looking at at the moment is this one here. So you've got three charms there, the tape measure, the yarn and the scissors. And then the other um, stitch markers are made up of gorgeous beads uh, which complement them beautifully. So what a great little set is that is. So her hampers are absolutely amazing. So there's one here which is a retro um, fabric um, and this is actually the last one that is left. So if you know someone that is really into retro um, then grab this while you can. Uh, this set is £33 um, and I'll tell you what it's made up of. So you get a pin cushion with storage, uh, you get a matching needle case, a portable pop-up thread catcher, a set of six pyramid sewing weights, a matching storage bag, a compact sewing kit and all that is placed in a wicker hamper that measures 30 centimetres by 23 by 12. Um, so an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous product there. So there we go. So if you know someone that is really into their sewing um, and you want to find them a special and unique gift, then look no further than gorgeous gifts on the marketplace. So I'm just going to check the comments again. Let's have a look. So Amy said she got um, the bag and scissor holder in the Secret Santa exchange. Well done. That was a lovely thing to receive. And Pete got a thread catcher. There you go. The thread cut I like the thread catchers because they um they flatten down so then when you want to use them you just pop them open, attach them to your workstation, um, put all your bits of thread and things in there as you are doing your projects, and then you can go and empty them afterwards and then pop it back down and put it away again. So I think they're absolutely incredible. So those are a few of our shops from our creatives um, who have the artisan package. Um, now I just wanted to show another shop here, um, which is M's Paper Love. Now Emma is one of our team who actually looks after um, the artisan toolbox and does all the fantastic posters. She's one of um, one of two members. Um, and Claire is the other one and I'll show her shop another time um, but Emma does these fantastic paper cuts um, and I just wanted to show you some of them because they are absolutely incredible I've actually had some of Emma's work previously for gifts for um, for my dad um, and I've been absolutely thrilled with um Filled with them, you know, they are cut beautifully, the designs are so intricate. Um, so I'm going to select this grey parrot here because I just think he is absolutely incredible. Um, if I just zoom in a little bit there, every single piece of that has been cut by hand, it's not done by a machine. Um, I've watched Emma do videos. Um, showing her cutting these by hand um, with a scalpel knife and I just think he is absolutely incredible um, if I knew somebody that was that you know that loved parrots I would be buying this because I just think the work that has gone into that is amazing now the design is by wild child designs but Emma has hand cut this herself um, so he's an African grey and he is gorgeous and such beautiful detail. Now, um, it's priced between £35 and £45. Pounds, and that is because you have the choice to select whether you want it framed or unframed. Um, which obviously affects uh, the, the, um, the price. Um, but he's absolutely incredible. I'm not sure if it says how large he, he is doesn't on this listing but I'm sure if you want to know the size then you could let um, ask Emma um, just drop her a message um, but she you know it's absolutely incredible some of the work that Emma has produced um, 
She does a lot of wild child designs templates, mm-hmm. but she does other ones as well. Um, what else can we have a look at? Let's have a look. What else shall I pick? Oh, we've got a sloth. So have we got any sloth lovers in the house this evening? Oh, he's just gorgeous. So he's priced between 20 and £30 pounds again because you've got the option to have him framed or unframed. Um, he's adorable. He looks like he's smiling at you. He does. He looks like he's giving you a little cheeky grin. Look great in any room. Again, it's a wild child design and hand cut by Emma. Absolutely incredible. She does lots of angels. Um, some incredible designs. So if you like to have um, this kind of thing up in your home, um, then you can't go wrong. you definitely find something you love in this shop. Um, so you might um, be an animal lover and you might like rabbits um, or know someone that keeps a rabbit as a pet. Oh, she's lovely. Um, so a hand-cut paper-cut uh, rabbit between 20 and £30. Pounds. Again, select whether you want framed or unframed. Um, she's so cute. I'm saying she's a she because she's got gorgeous eyelashes. So it's got to be a female rabbit. Um, um, you know, we have something here. So if you're buying something for a gentleman, you've also got a car paper cut. Um, again, the option of framed and unframed priced accordingly. So you are bound to find something for everybody. Um, Zodiac cuts as well. I've actually got one of the Leo ones because that's my Zodiac sign. I um, don't know whether she's got it still on here. But as you can see, um, some absolutely gorgeous. So again, please go over and um, show her some love in her shop. Absolutely incredible. Lots and lots of designs to choose from. So, yeah. So, those were my shops for this evening. So, just to recap, we had uh, Rainbow Roses Handmade for your room sprays and your candles. Uh, we had Pick and Mix Gifts for all your chocolate needs. Uh, we have Crafty Blue Cow um, for your Tooth Fairy pillows, your frames um, and your keyring fob charms um, for your pound coins for your trolley as well. We had gorgeous gifts for all your sewing needs. And then if you want a little bit of decor for your home, then you can pop over to M's Paper Love. So I'm just going to turn back round now. Um, cancel that. Let's flip the camera back round and come back onto the screen. And there we go. So if you want to shop for any of these fantastic gifts, then you just need to go to the link at the top of the screen, that way, uh, www.heartazan.uk.com. And have a mooch through all those fantastic shops and you'll find an awful lot more on there as well. So I hope you enjoyed um, looking at those with me this evening. Thank you for joining me guys. I'm going to go off now and get my pyjamas on and have a cup of tea and chill out. See if I can find something to watch on the TV for the next hour or so. Um, and do a bit of work as well I suppose. So thank you very much guys and we'll be back on Thursday because we're not on tomorrow. Um, so I will see you then. Take care. Thank you. Bye.